fish, yo. Motherfucking gay fish, gay fish, fish yo. What's up everyone, welcome back to Pokemon Soul Silver. we're here in Route 41, this is the top left of the World Islands, closer to Cyanwood City, but it's basically the one on the top, on the left side, um, you guys know there's four of them, one in each corner, so, anyway, we're here, you guys know exactly why, we're gonna catch Lugia today, um, I'm actually gonna be speeding up a little bit, but I'll still be narrating, actually, the first thing I wanna do is obviously set up Max Repel, and use our Togepi with Flash, which just isn't really... Very good, considering it's only level 1, and it's not going to help us catch Lugia in any way at all. But, um, yeah, the top left, um, island, the reason for that is because I want to get the most items that I can while I'm here in the World Islands before catching Lugia, so... I think this island is the most convenient for getting all the items and all the hidden items, so anyway... Starting off, um, let's get down here, there's two items that we can get right here, Max Elixir. And up on the corner, I believe, that is a full restore, and over there is that bald guy, but we're going to go back to him... In, the, in a few minutes, basically, so... For now, let's just grab all these items, and actually, I'm gonna speed up a little bit, because we're gonna need a lot of time to catch that Lugia, man. That thing is not a pushover. It's actually, even though it's level 45, compared to Ho-Oh in, um... In this game, you get Ho-Oh later on at level 70. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Spoilers. OMG. Um, but yeah, it's it's actually rather tough to get. So anyway, there's a full restore. Up there was a hidden item. It was a pearl, so sell those, get some monies... Everyone loves money, so, uh, let's play another repel, and, yeah, basically I'm speeding up because I, I, I want to get the most time out of catching Lugia, or for catching Lugia is what I'm trying to say. Um, let's go over here now. I think there's some more items here and there, so here is a super repel. That's not really going to come in very handy, but, you know, we can use that later on to, um, sell it or something. Probably sell it. Um, let's go down here. And here's another item. What is this? It's an escape rope. Alright, so these items aren't very good, to be honest, but there's definitely going to be some better ones um, eventually. So let's head up here. And this is actually the exit to the top, no, the, the bottom left one. Um, but we're not going to worry about that. And instead, we're going to head over here. There's another item tucked in the corner. It's an Ultra Ball. Okay, uh, alright, these items aren't very helpful right now, you know. I know there's some better ones sooner or later, alright, so just bear with me. Okay, another Ultra Ball. I guess that could help with Lugia, you know, I'm not complaining, but... Free items! Everyone loves free items, alright? Everyone loves them. Um, nothing up there, nothing over here. Let's head up here. What's this? It's a Calcium. That's pretty good. I mean, you can sell that or use it if you want to. I would recommend you sell it, though. Um, you know, 4900 bucks, and that's basically all there is to this, so... Now we're gonna head over to the top right island. Yep. That is the one, the top right island basically leads you to Lugia, so... You wanna head to that one once you've got all the items that you want, like I do, so... There we go, let's go ahead and use our Whirlpool powers, yay! And the top right island is somewhere over here, in this general direction. Yep, right here. So, yeah, for getting to Lugia, I'll just show you the basic, the most basic way. Basically, you wanna start out in this island, and I'll show you from there, but crap. Yeah, see, I, I didn't wanna, you know do that because now I have to go back in the water and come back into it and gosh why do I keep saying come back into it that's just retarded but anyway we're here in the world islands again we're gonna use flash up first and uh, I'm gonna show you how to get to Lugia in the easiest way possible um, a lot of you probably did figure it out but it just took you a while and freaking repel running out but there we go um, a lot of you probably figured it out you actually want to take the top path that item I'm just not gonna worry about it it's not it's probably nothing, like, very important. Maybe, like, a max revive or something, but... You know, it's good to have, but it's not like... Oh my gosh, if you don't have it, you're going to die or lose the game or something, but... There's a revive. That's about the only item on the way to Lugia, so... Just, just keep heading over here. Do not go over there. Instead, go down here. And... Here we are. This is basically it. There's two items in here, and... Yeah, I, I know I just said that was the last item before Lugia, but there's a full restore that's really good, actually. And here's a Max Revive, two very good items right there. And that is basically all there is to getting to Lugia. So here's this bald guy again. That thing you have! You have found it, please go ahead. Yep, that's the Silver Wing right there, so... Now we've got the Silver Wing, let's head in here. Ooh, pretty. But we're gonna worry about this. A rare candy! Oh my gosh! 
So they gave you a free rare candy right before fighting Lugia, I guess. I mean, I, I really don't know why you would need it, but sure. Um, I really like these slopes right here. They're really good. I, I, I don't know. I just find the design of them pretty good and how you can actually go up and down. That's something that really brought Pokemon up. But anyway, um, here we are. This is it, guys. We're going to go in. And we're going to fight Lugia. That's right. This is where we welcome Lugia. And the dance we practice many days be becomes one with the sound of the title bell we entrusted with you. Then Lugia shall come out from with deep within... Uh, Lugia shall come out from deep within the waterfall basin once again. Uh, I don't know. That just sounded weird to me. Lugia shall come out from deep within... Alright, so now they're gonna do their little dance, and honestly, there's just one kimono girl that's always, like, dancing differently from the other ones. Just look at her. The one right over on the right side now. I don't know, it just doesn't fit in with the whole dance, but whatever. This whole music right here reminds me of the game Okami, if you guys have ever played that, but it just reminds me, like, the music. It's kind of like Chinese, traditional kind of thing. So there we go. The title bell has activated something awesome. Yeah. And everyone, it's cutscene time! That is indeed Lugia, the guardian of these islands from ancient times. So many have tried, and again, only to fail. Orange, your heart in complete harmony with the title bell has finally allowed it to appear. Don't you see? Lugia, it must have been waiting for someone like you all this time. Wouldn't you agree? Actually, I really don't, um, but... You know, I'll take your word for it. And of course, they have to make us surf over to Lugia. So I guess we are going to head up to it. And, what the hell? Stop, stop doing that, man. Stop sucking on Lugia's, oh god. So because of time's sake, I'm just going to speed it up and play some awesome music. So here we go. Um, Lugia, basically, I mean... See, I'm going to still narrate over this, but Lugia is basically a big pain to catch. And uh, basically, what happened to me personally was, um, if you guys originally remember, I was planning to do this run side by side with Steel, and I still am, kind of. So, what happened was, I was originally going to use Lanchard instead of Gulduck, but because of stuff, I decided to trade, um, Steel was going to use Hi or Mamoswine originally, but... I traded that for my Lantern, and basically now he's got Lantern, and that really helped him out with catching his Legendary, and basically left me screwed, so it's really not a big problem for me, just rather, you know, I'm kind of screwed, but I'm just going to keep trying my best at using Dust Balls, and I'm probably going to fail to catch it, but, you know, I'm just going to keep trying, and look at that, I've already only got Red Rocket and Togepi left, um, Red Rocket can die to one Hydro Pump, but... You know, let's just keep trying our best, and hopefully, eventually, maybe we will catch it or something. Come on. Um, see, I don't have many choices right now. I mean, it's about to kill me with extra sensory, and now only Togepi is left, so... I am going to have to revive some Pokemans and hopefully survive a hit from it so that I can actually, you know, do stuff. Um, let's revive Seaman, considering he's like, oh my gosh, it missed. Great. Um, so now I can revive someone else, like Jug. And there it goes. Come on, Togepi, you had to die. You suck. Uh, so yeah, now I'm gonna go for another Dust Ball. See, if I had any paralyzing kind of thing, or anything like that, this would be a lot easier. But considering I don't, I am basically screwed. So it's basically all luck for me now. Um, and I'm using Dust Balls because I'm in a cave that's a little bit better than Ultra Balls. Actually, it could be exactly the same, but I really don't remember at the moment, so... This is basically my... Yes! 
Yes! Freaking yeah! Oh my god! Okay, this thing would have hit me right now, I would have been dead. But there we go, everyone! We've caught ourselves Lugia! And again, I'm sorry for super speeding, but I put the music there, so... Alright, we're not giving it a nickname, we have caught ourselves Lugia! Uh, take that, Steel! You needed that lantern to catch I, I didn't need anything! Just skills, man! Skills! So there we go, everyone! We've got ourselves Lugia, and that is basically all there is to it. They don't even have anything to finish off, so... Let's just use our awesome digging powers, and we're gonna GTFO! See you guys next time.